Zoe, you captain Canada to three World Cup games in seven days. Um, how do you reflect on the last week? I just think that uh, being here in India is just such an amazing experience. It's something that I really uh, will never forget. Obviously, this last game didn't go the way we wanted, but I think each and every one of us learned so many lessons from each game, and it's only we're only going to get better, and we're going to take these lessons and use them for the future. But I think to have a World Cup here in India to inspire so many young girls um, it is really amazing. So I'm honored to represent Canada and also to, to play here. And on a personal level, you're the leader of this group. Uh, what kind of impact do you have in the dressing room when it comes to a tough loss like this? I think just trying to stay positive. I think every single person on this team has been impacted no matter how many minutes they played, what their role is, and just reminding everybody that um, journeys are hard, but you know, this, this is a part of it. So I think just keeping that in mind. And I think Canada's made a really good impact in the women's soccer universe almost. Um, how, how do you see the senior team as a, a stepping stone or a pathway that you know your young players can get into? Oh, absolutely. I think that. Um, as our coach said, like getting into domestic league is something that is, yeah. is truly going to be a, such a great stepping stone in getting that into, into our senior team. And right now, our senior team is doing so well. Um, and each and every one of us is looking towards our um, our seniors, and I think that this experience and, and so on will only help us uh, to advance into the senior team hopefully one day. Do you have any role models on the senior team? I do. Um, Keisha Buchanan and uh, my young my young one who just came in, Jade Rose. Uh, always looking up to them. Them, Vanessa Gilles. Jay Rose, Jordan Heitmar, they've all come out of the under-17 age group. Yeah. What's next for this team and the players? I think it's only up from here. I know this is a tough loss, but there's so much talent on this team. And um, as we know, like the last 17s group had some really incredible players, so it's very exciting for us for the future. All right, outside of football the last seven days, how has it been in this country and what are your takeaways? Oh, I think it's beautiful. I think being able to go to Goa and obviously see that part of India and coming here to Mumbai, it's just something I'll never forget. It's just such, it's such an experience to be exposed to so much culture and just... Um, such an amazing place. All the best and I hope to see you on my TV very soon. Thank you so much.